All right. Good morning, girls. I haven't seen you guys in so long. I miss you. Um, I'm going to show you what I want you to do in your binder. So I have Ria's and I have Celine's right here. They're both the same, so I'm just going to show you in Celine's. The only thing that you guys need to share from these binders is your Reading A to Z book. Okay, so it's going to be in the front of Celine's binder, but it's not just for Celine. Okay, it's for Rhea too. So I want you guys to be able to share the book. All right. Okay. So in the very front of your book, you have all the websites that you need to use. And you can ask Nana to help you with this and she'll help you find the websites that you need. Okay, it has all your passwords right there. And then today, let's see, then you have your rainbow words. So Celine is on yellow. Rhea, I have your blue words in there too. So once you learn them, you can test with Nana and she'll tell me and then I can send your new words when you're done, okay? All right. So we're gonna turn to Tuesday, which is blue. And the very first thing you, you have is your math, okay? So for this, I need you to get a pencil and get ready to count. So Nana might need to be here to help you with this. If not, you can do it all by yourself, okay? So I want you to write your name and date right here. And then I want you to point as you count each number, okay? So let's go ahead and do this together. One, two, three, four. Make sure you're saying it along with me, okay? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So Celine, you sometimes forget number 15, so don't skip 15, okay? 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. If you still counting with me? Make sure you're saying it out loud. 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Good job. Okay, we're gonna turn the page. On this side, um, you're gonna point to each number as you count to 100 again, but I want you to stop and circle number 11. So what's number 11? Two ones, one and one is number 11. So circle that one. Then start at 11 and count forward until you get to 100. And I want you to draw a line under 100. Okay, draw a line under 100, circle number 11. When you're done with that, we'll go on to the next page. So go ahead and pause it if you need a minute, and then we'll move on, okay? Okay, we're back. The next one is this green 100 chart. So. I want you to point to each number as you count to 100 again, but this time you're gonna look away and you're gonna point to a number. And then you're gonna look at it and say, oh, 34. So it's kind of like you're doing a quiz for yourself, but you're gonna look away, point, look back, 77. Okay, so go ahead and do some of that practice. I want you to do that at least 10 times, okay? And then when you're done, Oh, and every time you point to the number and you get it, circle that number, okay? So that, so that I know when I see it, oh, they did that one. Or if you have um, a colored pencil or a crayon, you could just color that number. That might be fun, okay? Just do that so that I can see how many times you looked away and pointed and did it, okay? So go ahead and make sure you circle or color that number. 
um, when you're done, I want you to draw another line under the 100 on this one. Okay? So pause the video now, go do that, and then come back. Okay, are you ready to keep going? I want you to put your finger on number 15. Do you see number 15? One, five. Put your finger on it. Then I want you to write the numbers that are neighbors to number 15, okay? So 15, so we have, we have count four, we have 11, 12, 13, something 15, something 17. So I want you to write what goes on each side of 15. What's its number neighbors? Go ahead and write those. And then when you're done, you can write the missing ones up here. What comes between four and six and between 24 and 26, okay? So do with that. Pause the video and come back, okay? Okay, you ready? It says draw to show what you know about some other number neighbors on the chart. So you could pick a number on the chart and then write what you know about the number neighbors or draw it, okay? You could draw 15 right here and then you could draw 16 and 14 or you could do uh, 90, 91, 89, something like that, okay? I don't want you to do those two numbers I just gave you. I want you to come up with your own, okay? So go ahead and do that, and then we will move right on to handwriting, okay? Okay, are you ready for handwriting? Today, we have a whole new handwriting thing that we're doing, okay? So we're on lesson one, write your name. So on each of these, do you see the little dots right there? Dot, 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 dot. Those are where you start your letter. So you're gonna draw this O, and then I want you to draw it again, and I want you to draw one every time you start at that um, dot. I don't want you to draw in between, just at the dot, okay? So make sure that your O starts at the dot, touches the bottom, come back up, okay? Do that here and do that here. Then you're gonna do lowercase, okay? Do the same thing. Over here, you're gonna do a circle and a line, a circle and a line, circle, line. Do that pattern over and over. Same thing right here. Then you're gonna do lowercase circle and line, okay? Same thing down here, same thing down here. That should be pretty easy. It shouldn't take you very long. Um, when you are done, oh, make sure you use a pencil so that you can erase if you need to. And when you're done, we're gonna move on to phonics, okay? Okay, go ahead and pause. Do your handwriting, come back for phonics. Okay, here we go, phonics. The first one we're doing is PH, okay? I'm going to show you a secret story if I had it. Where'd it go? Aha. I'm gonna show you the secret story for PH. So PH, they are pranksters, okay? And P and H like to call people and pretend to be Mr. F. So they'll call somebody and go, fff, 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 and they'll hang up really quick. And people think, oh, that was Mr. F, when really, it was Sneaky PH. You see them? They're calling people, they're sneaky, they're pretending to be Mr. F, they have a mustache, cat pretending to be him. So whenever PH gets, and P and H get together, they make the sound, fff, okay? So we're gonna look at this fff, sound. We're gonna go through here. You're gonna need scissors and stick glue for this, okay? I sent those both in bags for you. So if you can't find them, go ahead and ask Nana, but you have them at home. So I want you to cut out these right here. So go ahead and pause the video, cut these out, and then come back when they're cut out, okay? Pause right now. Okay, ready? So I want you to glue the correct PH word under each of these pictures. So first we have nephew, microphone, dolphin, elephant, graph, photo, telephone, sphere. Okay? So sound these words out. Make sure that you have them, that you glue them on the right ones, okay? Pause the video, do that, come back when you're done. All right, if you are done, we're gonna move on to the next PH one. Remember PH makes? Okay, so it says PH sound color red. 
no pH sound, color blue. So you need a blue and a red crayon or colored pencil. I don't want you to use marker because then it's gonna bleed through the other side to the other part of your book. So just crayon or colored pencil. So we're gonna go through each of these and I want you to color them red or blue as we go, okay? This is going to whiskers. Do you hear a f in whiskers? What about dolphin? Is there a f in dolphin? Telephone, wheel, whip, sheep, microphone, graph, alphabet, thumb, photo, shell, ribbon, elephant, church, bath. Okay, go ahead and color all those, either blue or red. When you're done, so pause the video now, come back when you're done. Okay, if you're done, we're going to go ahead and start reading our book. This one, I want you to open and read along with me, okay? I'm going to read it to you the first time with you. So if you want to read it by yourself first, you can pause it and come back when you're ready. This is called, What's My Job? What's my job? Women I know do many jobs. A woman I know makes art. A woman I know is a boss. A woman I know drives a truck. A woman I know is a teacher. A woman I know works at the zoo. I will do a job one day. Now my job is to play. That's a nice book about all the different jobs, or some of the different jobs that women do. So what I want you to do is you have your worksheet in front of you. That's your W worksheet, okay? So each of these things that starts with a W, I want you to write W right there on it, okay? So uppercase and lowercase. So we have watermelon, window, worm, zoo, truck, wagon, web, wig, woman. Okay? If one of those things started with a W sound, I want you to write the W sound. If not, leave it blank. When you are all done, you may color the pictures with, again, not a marker, but a pencil, a colored pencil, or a crayon. Okay? So go ahead and pause the video, do that, and then come back when you're done.